Okay, time to uh, record each line up the pole. Now we go to sounds, put a new sound, and when we click record, we start talking. The subtle brown leaves falling on the rough ground. The subtle brown leaves falling on the rough ground. Next one. The amazing trees reaching for the sky. The amazing trees reaching for the sky. The wonderful views of the National Park. The wonderful views of the National Park. And so on and so on. So we can go down and do each line. But I'm going to show you a different way of doing it using a little program called eSpeak where you can actually write the text into a text file and have the sound file created using the terminal. So let's do the next three lines using a little program called eSpeak. The way it works is you, you copy the text into a text file, which I just happen to have set up here, with a little bit of space. So let's do three lines. And there's number three. Now we'll save that. It's called sensory text. Now we'll open up our terminal. And the first thing we'll do is go to the directory where we saved. So and then we run eSpeak. You speak is quite a neat little program. You can play with all these different things here, the settings, so speed, modulation, all sorts of stuff. Tempo, the whole nine yards. So sensory text, we want to write to a WAV file, a sound file. So we hit that. We can now get out of terminal. We can close that. And we can go and have a look at what we've created. The birds playfully chirping in the trees. I see the white fluffy clouds reflecting on the water. The floral flowers blooming and showing off. Now there's lots of different ways you can make that voice sound different. We'll just run with that for the moment. So what we do is we'll go back to number four. And it doesn't really matter. And we will upload that sound file. So... Here it is, and we'll play it. The birds playfully chirping in the trees. I see the white fluffy clouds reflecting on the water. The floral flowers blooming and showing off. Now, you duplicate and split. So what you want is the first one. The birds playfully chirping in the trees. And so you get rid of the rest of it, like so, so it comes up as one file and then you just cut it into pieces. Second one, you want to get rid of the first bit, like so, and the last bit, and the third one. You get rid of the first part. So now you've got the birds playfully chirping in the trees. 
I see the white fluffy clouds reflecting on the water. The floral flowers blooming and showing off. Alright, so we can adjust the volume a bit. For those ones that are a bit loud. And we just highlight it and then hit the effect and make it a bit softer. And let's have a listen to how that sounds. The birds playfully chirping in the trees. So that's putting it back about the wonderful views of the National Park. Okay, so we'll do the three of them. Take them down a little bit. Do the last one as well. Just take the volume down a bit so they're all about the same. How does that sound? The floral flowers blooming and showing off. So the rest of the sounds need to be put in. Once all the sounds have been put in, we'll then adjust our script to play the sounds to synchronise with each line of the poem. <laughs> 